R E S P E C T. Respect. What happened to the respect, man? I've I've been seeing a whole bunch of um how how do I say this um, disrespect and or um, straight coonery towards our older generations. I, I'm I'm not feeling it that much. Well, I'm not feeling it at all. This is ridiculous. This makes no sense. Absolutely no sense. There is not even a reason to why a 16 year old or an 18 year old should be cursing out some old lady at a fast food restaurant. Have, have y'all ever seen any of these things on uh, on YouTube on World Star Hip Hop? You know a uh, dude goes off on the guy on the bus, gets reckless, gets big and it's like all in caps and stuff bringing attention to it. It's a horrible sight to see. Like truthfully and to be as honest with you as I can that's, that's just horrible. Where are the parents of these kids at? They need to get their ass beat. Not only the kids. Like, let me let me let me go ahead and um break this down for y'all. This is how it usually goes. Um, excuse me, baby, you. What you want, bitch? Huh? What you want, old bitch? The fuck you looking at me for? Get the fuck out of my face! Oh, you old motherfuckers. See, I can't stand y'all old bitch ass motherfuckers. Always trying to mess with us because we young. Bitch, go eat some pudding. That's that's what you need to do. Go go eat some goddamn pudding. Well, I was just trying to say, baby, that your wallet was coming out your back pocket, and I didn't want you to lose any change. Change? Change? What you mean change? Bitch, I'm balling. I don't need no goddamn change. I got nothing but bills in my pockets anyway. How the fuck this gonna fall out? You see my fat ass? This fat ass right here is gonna hold all this, you old hag ass bitch. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make you mad. I didn't know that was gonna happen. I, I'm just standing in the line like the rest of us. Well, bitch, maybe you should be in a walker. Huh? Where's your fucking wheelchair? You old bald ass bitch. That's why you wearing a wig now. You old ugly motherfucker got all the moles on your face. You was probably a lunch lady in your 30s, huh? You old bitch. Fuck you mean. Get your old bitch ass out here. Don't don't be talking to me. I'll beat you in your motherfucking head, bitch. I'm trill. I'm trill, motherfucker. Yeah, you heard me. Well, I'm sorry. I didn't... You know what? Why am I apologizing? This is some bullshit. I'm too old and I've fought for too many of your rights to have to go through this, baby. Now let me tell you something. If it was up to me, I'm just saying, if it were up to me, I would whoop your ass until you felt every bit of segregation. I can't stand your young whippersnappers nowadays because you always got something to say out your goddamn mouth. Now I'm letting you know now, if you say one more thing, I will take off this belt and beat the black into you. Go girl, this belt won't feel like a whip. If you see somebody acting up like that, assist that old lady. Assist that old man. Try and see what the problem is, cause that's ridiculous. Fucking ridiculous. Besides kicking a baby, I, I think that's one of the, the most the, the lowest things you could ever do is talk back to an adult with such disrespect. Let me even look at my grandmama wrong. If I look at my grandmama wrong, I'm getting hit in the face. You know what I'm saying? Something's going to happen and I'm not going to even see it coming. You know, I was raised that way. You respect your elders no matter what. No matter if they wrong or if they right. Alright? If, if they saying something, you listen. Young, old, whatever. Please, show some more respect. This is stupid. This is absolutely stupid, ridiculous. It's absurd. It's grotesque. It's every negative thing you could possibly think of. They was here before you. Show a little bit of gratitude. I don't have no goddamn attitude. I will beat your narrow ass until you so God. I will beat your narrow ass until you stopped at a red light and thought to yourself, wow, I really need to get a job. I will beat your narrow ass until all them extensions came flying out of you. When I'm finished with you, you will have so many bruises to the face. They ain't gonna understand if you were Sugar Shane Mosley or Rihanna after that ass whooping. I'd beat your ass so bad you wouldn't know what your middle name is. I would beat your ass so bad that you would forget who your daddy was. Well, you probably don't remember who he is anyway. That's why your ass so fucked up now. Ain't got no goddamn father figure in your household. I would beat your ass so ruthlessly that even the people in the church wouldn't let me back in. I would beat your ass with all the powers of the gods. I would beat your ass like Billy Blanks on a football field. I would beat your ass like an angry caveman. I would beat your ass like your daddy should have did itself. 
Because if you would have beat yourself, you would have left that shit there in the toilet. And if it was in the toilet, your ass would be swimming around somewhere with them fishes and gators. And you wouldn't be born right now talking all this bullshit to a young elderly woman. I call myself young and elderly because I'm wise, but I'm a sexy bitch now. Don't get it misconstrued, little hoe. Now, uh, wait a minute. Hold on. I'll be back with your young ass. Hey, Jesse. Jesse, is that you, boy? How you doing? I miss you. You know that we've been down at the church wondering when you're going to bring the rest of your children over and we're going to have us a good old Sunday Bible study. Okay. All right. Well, well i see you sometime then, sweet. I love you. And may God bless you. All right. Now, back to you, little ignorant bitch.